all my exes, they probably still love me. Probably some unwords that need to be said, some closure, but I don't think there's gonna be no bad blood between us. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? It's Jared here. I'm 31 years old, and you probably know me from F Boy Island. Honestly, I don't know why. <laughs> I feel like I had the pick of the litter. It's really hard to choose in this day and age. I mean, I'm really trying to find, you know, that perfect match, someone that can fit into my lifestyle as well as I can fit into theirs. I mean, I'm a lover boy. I try to give 100% to each one of my relationships. Unfortunately, I'm still single and I haven't found that exact person yet, but hopefully she's here. I look for honesty, respect, and I definitely trust someone who's really trustworthy. All my exes, I have so much respect for them. To bring them onto the beach when I'm trying to find something new, I have no clue what's gonna happen. I, I don't wanna see any of them right now. No, 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 none of my exes, um, we have any bad blood. I think that all my exes, they probably still love me. Probably some unwords that need to be said, some closure, but I don't think there's gonna be no bad blood between us. <laughs> Worst date I've ever been on, I got stood up. I mean, you probably won't believe that, but yeah, a texting, calling, and she just never, ever showed up. And I kinda had, <laughs> I kinda had a dinner date by myself that night. <laughs> that was kinda the worst thing I've ever, I'm like, how you just, and then she blocked me. I couldn't find her no more, it was kinda weird. I was like, maybe she was a catfish. <laughs> My biggest ick is someone who's just disloyal. I love a person who is just gonna give me 100% of honesty and uh, love and compassion. I could ride a unicycle. I mean, think about it, I'm not in the circus, but I can ride a unicycle. My biggest celebrity crush will probably be Megan Fox, I think that, you know, she's just a stunning, beautiful, all around and amazing woman. <laughs> the best thing about being in love is just the little things. It's the little gestures that you get from that same person. It's the honesty, it's the, the caring. I love love. It's the, something that you can build. I don't think it just happens overnight. I've never, use the pickup line. I feel bad for the pickup lines because like, I mean, I get you want to make a person smile and feel comfortable, but yeah, my pickup line is, hey, how you doing? <laughs> yeah, I said it to a few people's DMs. I'm not going to lie about that. My opening line is just probably with the eye emoji or just, hey, I seen you was here. Do I know you from somewhere? Just really simple stuff, you know? <laughs> The best piece of relationship advice someone has ever told me is to form a real good bond with that person. Communication is truly the most important thing in a relationship. <laughs> I spilled like red wine all over my clothes. That was really embarrassing, but luckily the lady was all cool and calm. She accepted, she thought it was funny, you know? I mean, I, I have done so many things. Picnics, a nice five-star dinner. I've taken women outside the country. I mean, there's so many things you can do that makes romance such a good thing. No, I never got a revenge on any of my exes. I don't believe in revenge. I think that it just, it's kind of just immature. 